Mobile's an area that a lot of people talk about when trying to extend a TV show. Um, I'm going to talk about mobile apps in particular. If you look at the App Store or the Android Store, you'll find there are very few TV shows or branded shows in the top 100. That's because most of the apps are made up of games or utilities, like how to collect your email. There are a few exceptions, and I looked at the top 100 iTunes apps recently, and there were four, four TV shows and four TV services available. In the free area, you get services like iPlayer, 4OD, ITV Player, applications you can download for free and then watch content that would have advertising within it. That's obvious, that's understandable. In the paid for it area, because we're talking about making money here, there are very few TV examples. There are a few game shows that have translated very well to mobile apps, Deal or No Deal, Who Wants to Be a Millionaire, Million Pound Drop, the obvious candidates. But there are a few others that were interesting and worthy of note. Phone Jacker and Face Jacker, they're both soundboards where clips from the TV show have been recorded and put into apps for you to play back. It seems really too simple, but I think a lot of people have fun and games, maybe in the playground or work, playing different silly sounds to their friends. These have, these have been downloaded in their hundreds of thousands and have made good money for their producers without them being the big shows like Big Brother or X Factor. Channel 4 has begun commissioning some of these apps as well. Um, Embarrassing Bodies, you'll find, has done very well as a free app to give medical advice related to things from the television show. So there is money to be made, there are ways of extending your show into mobile apps, but you've got to be very careful that not very many genres of TV program translate particularly well. I'd probably stick to game shows, youth orientated shows, or maybe cooking shows. We've seen Jamie Oliver have a successful app, Gordon Ramsay to a lesser extent, and Nigella Lawson as well. So it's clearly an area of some demand where people will pay for these services, mainly to get to the recipes and the techniques of how you make the food. So don't bet the mortgage on it or the house, but certainly an area of interest.